Hey guys, happy Saturday. We are getting ready to go on our first family walk and I'm super excited. Joe spent the past like 30 minutes putting together this stroller. I'm like falling over today. Putting together the stroller for the first time because we did not get that built before she got here, but we haven't needed it up until now. Who's the cutest baby in the freaking world with this? Look at this. Are you kidding me right now? You're like really cute. <laughs> You're like really cute and stuff. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Herps. You're hey, pooping. No matter what mood I'm in, no matter how tired I am, if ever I hear her toot, I instantly smile. It's like a reflex. Cause you're so cute when you toot. You want your babas? Do you want a babas? Oh, you do want babas. Harper. Harper. Hey. <laughs> How's it going? Boop. Boop. <laughs> <laughs> that was real cute, Harper. Boop. Hi everybody. Watch this. Watch. I'm gonna get her to suck. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you do that to her? It's terrible. <laughs> so cute. She has a little kitten on her butt. It's <laughs> so cute. If you can't tell, I've been kind of in the mood for fall. So this is the stroller all set up. It came with a bassinet. Um, insert and then a normal one ah! for when they sit down. So, yeah, I think I'm gonna swaddle her up and put her in it. You ready to be swaddled? Is that good enough? Is that good enough? Are you ready for your walk? How do you like it, Harper? Do you like it? You wanna go? You gotta go for a walk. Yeah. We well, gotta go on a family walk, and that means you. They're so excited. If you can't tell, it's been a while. <laughs> and we are ready to go. Okay, so you want me to grab the dogs, you grab the baby? No, oh, we're going on our first family walk. <laughs> we're rolling. We're rolling hearts. Very, yes. These dogs, man, are really, <laughs> they could pull my whole body if I let them. Let's get this, it was really cute. She was really liking it. She was really liking it with the smiles and everything. Let me see if I can do this all on my own. Impossible. Three dogs, three dogs and a baby. Impossible. Can I look cheap though? Yeah. Here, <laughs> so our first family walk was a success. Remember this thing? <laughs> that is my summer bucket list. Believe it or not, I have been working on these things. I just haven't been vlogging it. But I have my summer bucket list recap video coming up, so I'm trying to get a few things um, crossed off. Go on a family walk. Flip this one over. So now we're headed out soon to go to visit with the birth parents. Um, it's been a couple of weeks since they saw her. Garbage disposal going. So now we're leaving in a little bit to go visit with the birth parents. It's been a couple of weeks since um, they've seen her. The last time they saw her was at the barbecue, which was in my last vlog. So I'm super excited for them to see Harper. She has grown so so much in just the two weeks since they've seen her. Which was why I texted her. Because I was like, you guys need to see her soon because she gets different by the day. And so I didn't want her to grow too much without them seeing her. Crystal Pepsi, back in action. And it is good. I haven't tasted it yet. Come on, let's do it right now. Brittany, taste Crystal Pepsi for the first time. Yep. 
you suddenly realize it's amazing. It tastes like a mixture between Diet Pepsi and Sprite. No, it doesn't taste like Diet. Yeah. It's got okay, real cane sugar. You know what we need to do? We need to do a blind taste Why test. Why are you looking at me? Like this. You know what we need to do? <laughs> That's what it looked like. <laughs> we need to do a blind taste test where I taste blindfolded this one and the real one and see if I can taste it. You'll it definitely taste. know the difference. There's a little slight difference. Exactly. If there was no difference, there'd be no point. Come on. No, that's the whole point is for there to be Exa no difference. No, there's exactly a point. It's a different product. I love it. Well, then I stand by what I said. It what? tastes like Pepsi mixed with Sprite. So I have been shopping for Harper's first Halloween costume, which there's a lot of pressure with that because I feel like you only have your very first Halloween costume once in your life. And so I feel like I just want it to be something that's very memorable and obviously very cute. So I had five Halloween costumes that I was trying to decide between. So I went on Instagram and I made a little collage of all five and I told people to vote on what they think Harper's first Halloween costume has been. So it's been really fun reading all of the comments all day. So far number five is winning, but I thought number one would get a little bit more attention. There's only been like three people out of 153 votes that have voted for uh, number one. So if you're not following me on Instagram, it's Brit Paradise. It's not Bits of Paradise. I have that account, but then I never used it. And then now it won't let me switch over the name because that account, that account is being used, but I'm nervous to delete that account because I don't want to forever lose the name. So I'm most active on that social media. I'm not really on Twitter or Facebook or Snapchat. So the birth grandmother gave me one of Eva's very first Halloween costume, which Eva, is Sarah's daughter. She made this for Eva and it's a tickle monster costume. How absolutely adorable is that? It has all of these little um, feathers on it. And then this is a little hat. It's just so adorable. So she gave that to me for Harper to wear. I'm gonna give it back to her once Harper's worn, worn it, but she's way too small. I think she'll fit in it maybe next year. Um, I think that I'll try to fit her in it this year and just take a little picture of her. I'm really blue and send it to her, but I don't think that she's going to fit in it. So I'm trying to find another costume. <laughs> I shouldn't do this. With the makeup on, Brittany. With the makeup on. I'm going to do it. I'm just going to jump in. I'm just going to do it. Okay, so. Hey, guys. <laughs> it is um, Sunday morning. We got back around 9 o'clock last night and it was hard to put Harper down. She's definitely the kind of baby that um, she just needs to have a schedule and a routine like the same every day. Like if you mess it up at all, she doesn't recover well from it. So we tried taking her out and having kind of like the bedtime routine at Ben and Sarah's house um, and then just coming home and transferring her from her car seat to her bassinet, but she wasn't having any. But anywho, it was really nice visiting with them so that they could see Harper. But I wanted to show you a couple things that we got at their house. So um, Harper's birth great-grandmother got her a card. Oh no, please tell me I put the card in here, okay. Whew. <laughs> um, she got her a card. And then she got her this adorable, cute little um, outfit. Comes with these pants and then came with this shirt, which was so sweet of her. And then I actually got to talk to her on the phone and kind of meet her over the phone. And she's like literally just the sweetest, sweetest lady. I hope that we can um, meet her someday and she can meet Harper. And then Sarah found this and gave it to me. She was telling me about it before and it's funny because I thought that this was her daughter in it and she was telling me to like use it and I'm like, what? You want me to take the pictures out? But then this doesn't look like her daughter Eva at all, but like this kind of does. So I was like so confused <laughs> when she gave it to me. But this is just a frame that she found and she thought that it would be cute for me to put um, Harper's pictures in it. So it has one month, two month, three month, and then it goes all the way up to a year. So Harper has three birth sisters. Uh, my brother has two daughters, and then Sarah has a daughter, Eva. 
Um, so right now we just call them cousins and I'm pretty sure Kiz, I don't know if they all made this for her or if Kismet, I think just Kismet. And it's a little crown. I just thought that was so sweet of her. They all kind of came up to me and uh, gave this to me and they were all just saying how much they loved her and it was just such a sweet moment. So yeah, I just thought that, that was super cute and I just loved having things like that that Harper can look back on and always have and I'm excited to see how their relationship kind of grows throughout the years and everything. So yeah, it was a good, good Saturday. Why am I ending this vlog without makeup on? I don't know. Do it new. It's funny, I don't go in public or like even let my friends see me without makeup on, but for some reason I vlog without makeup on. Doesn't make any sense. Anywho, I'm gonna end here. Thanks for spending this Saturday with us. I'm hoping to continue to get back onto my normal YouTube schedule. I think for this Wednesday's video, I'm gonna do Harper's um, photo shoot. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye.